a very good afternoon to everyone. My name is Ayush Adho and I am a student of Faculty of Engineering and Technology, Department of Civil Engineering, University of Lucknow. My topic for the seminar presentation is Plastic Roads in India. Here is the content of my presentation. It includes the introduction, the need of the study, materials used, construction process, advantages of plastic roads and disadvantages of plastic roads. Introduction Disposal of waste plastic is a major problem. It is non-biodegradable and it mainly consists of low density polyethylene. Burning of these waste plastic bags causes environmental pollution on large scale. In 2015, the Indian government made it mandatory for plastic waste to be used in constructing roads near large cities of more than 5 lakh people after Dr. Rajkopalan Vasudevan gave his patent for the system to government for free. A single lane of ordinary road requires 10 ton of bitumen per kilometer and with India laying thousands of kilometers of roads a year, the potential to put plastic waste to use quickly adds up. Plastic roads mainly use plastic carry bags disposable cups and bottles that are collected from garbage dumps as an important ingredient of the construction material. What are plastic roads? The roads constructed using waste plastic popularly known as plastic roads and are performed better compared to those constructed with conventional bitumen. The ICP Indian Center for Plastics in the Environment has been promoting the use of waste plastic to construct asphalt roads. A few trials roads have been paved successfully by combining waste plastic with bitumen. ICP Mumbai has sanctioned a proper order from the Government of India in accordance with the norms of CRRI, CPCB and IRC. What is the need of the study? Disposal of waste plastic is a major problem. Waste plastic is dumped on roads. It is non-biodegradable. It mainly consists of low density polyethylene, as you can see in the image. When openly present, it is filthy. It is sometimes consumed by stray animals. It also creates choking in the wastewater and sewage drainage system when it flows through them. Burning of these waste plastic bags causes environmental pollution on large scale. So here's my case study for this topic. From where has this concept come from? So the concept of utilization of waste plastic in bitumen mixes for road construction has been done in since 2001 in India at the initiative of Dr. Rajkopal and Vasudevan, a study on the possible use of processed plastic waste blacks with the bitumen mixes was carried out at the Thea Garjar College of Engineering in Madurai as far as back 2001. A group of students a B.Tech degree course in chemical engineering under the guidance of the concerned teaching staff and the professor carried out this final year project for studying the possibility of use of processed plastic bags with vitamin and vitamin mixes. The patent for this innovation was given to Rajgopal Vasudevan whereas the patent for using this concept and for, for construction was given to KK Polyflex com company Bangalore. As some encouraging results were reported in the study, KK Polyflex Private Limited later approached the Center for Transportation and Engineering of Bangalore University with the request to carry out further research studies on the effects of using processed plastic bags with the vitamin mixes for road construction works and so that they can get proper orders from the government of India for construction roads using plastic waste. Materials used are aggregate of size 20 mm and 10 mm stone dust and lime as filler, between 60 by 70 grade, 80 by 100 grade as per the specifications of IRC, CPCB and CRRI. Waste plastic is used in shredded form. Here are the government norms for the plastic road construction. Vasudevan used 10% of waste plastic of bitumen quantity, whereas CRRI used 8%. IRC has said 6 to 8%, whereas CPCB has said 5 to 20 percent. So here is the process of construction. Plastic waste made of low density polyethylene 
polypropylene and polystyrene is cut into size of between 2.36 mm and 4.75 mm using shredded machine. The aggregate mix is heated to 165 degrees Celsius as per the CRI specification and transferred to mixing chamber. Amount of plastic added is around 8% of bitumen. At some places, 6% is also preferred in hilly areas so that leaching skid resistance can be increased. Similarly, the bitumen is to be heated up to maximum 160 degrees Celsius to have good binding and to prevent weak bonding. At the mixing chamber, the shredded plastic waste is to be added. It gets coated uniformly over the aggregate within 30 to 60 seconds, giving it an oily look, as you can see in the image on the left hand side part. The waste plastic coated aggregate is mixed with hot bitumen and resulted mix is used for road construction. The road link temperature is between 110 degrees Celsius to 120 degrees Celsius and the rollers used are of 8th in generally. So here are the field methods used. There are two methods, dry process and wet process. Dry process is preferred more and it is, has been accepted on large scale since it is easy to manhandle and to work it. Whereas wet process requires a lot of investment and bigger plants to operate. Here is the comparison between properties of plastic road and ordinary road. As you can see from the chart, the stability for plastic road is more. As you can see, the marshal stability value is 17.50 km, whereas for ordinary road, it is 15.60 km. Plastic road has better binding property, it has lesser potholes, seepage water is not present, durability of road is more, and maintenance is very less as compared to ordinary road. What are the advantages of waste plastic between road? Stronger road with increased marshal stability as we had seen in the previous chart, no stripping, no potholes, increasing binding, no effect of radiation like UV. The strength of road is increased roughly by 30% as per the study of CPCB. The load withstanding property increases. It helps to satisfy today's need of increased road transport. For 1 km length, 3.7 m width and 3 cm height, 1 ton of plastic is used and 1 ton of vitamin is saved. The cost of road construction is reduced for around 40 to 50,000 rupees for the given damage. The maintenance cost of road is almost nil. Disposal of waste plastic will no longer be a problem as this solution has come up. Benefits of waste plastic road Environmental benefits Municipal solid waste manage management increases as waste plastic is being used in roads construction. Employment generation is created as a, as a large work labor force is required for constructing plastic roads. National economy increases as bitumen is being saved. What are the disadvantages of plastic road? Some drawbacks of these roads are the foremost drawback is the cleaning process. Toxics present in the commingled plastic waste would start leaching. So the cleaning on such large scale is quite difficult and complicated. During the road link process, in the presence of chlorine, will definitely release noxious acyl gas which is harmful for health. After the road link, it is opined for the first end will trigger some amount of leaching. So here are some waste plastic roads constructed in India. The first road was constructed in Kovilapatti village in Tudira Koran district in October 2002 as a part of research by Dr. Vasudevan, Tamil Nadu has constructed longest plastic road network in India, whereas Himachal Pradesh has banned plastic in 2008 and is promoting the culture of buying plastic for road construction. Since Jamshedpur is the industrial capital of India adopted by the Tata Group, the Jasko Group by Tata is also making plastic roads on large scale. The Shankar Mut Road, the Millers Road, Inner Ring Road, Mysore Junction, Mysore Bangalore State Highway, Putana Chetty Town Hall Road, Dollars Colony Bangalore, Manipal Road and the later half of the MG Road is also being constructed by the plastic used in bitumen mix. Inclusion The evidence of better performance of plastic roads The performance studies carried out on the roads constructed in Tamil Nadu indicated satisfactory performance with good skid resistance and good texture value, stronger and less amount of progressive unevenness over a period of time. The experimentation carried out by CRI also indicated better stability value, indicating higher strength and less flow. 
the use of innovative technology not only extended the road construction but also increased the road life as well as will improve the environment and also creating a source of income plastic roads would be a boon for india's hot and extremely humid climate leaving most of the roads with big potholes it is a hope that in near future we will have strong durable and eco friendly roads which will clean the earth from all type of plastic waste hence the use of waste plastic for payment is one of the best methods for easy disposal of waste plastic but it is our duty to properly segregate waste plastic in our home so that waste plastic used for construction is more and more and we can remove waste plastic from the environment here are the references of my case seminar lucknow has recently got its first proposal for constructing a waste plastic road from gomtinagar police station to iim choraha and it will be successfully be completed by the year 2024 plastic roads a simple way to make eco friendly constructions thank you